everyone, welcome back. I just did a monster grocery shopping haul. I went to Walmart, Sam's Club, and Walmart and Sam's Club. Oh yeah, and PetSmart, duh. I have to go get the cat food out of the car. So let's get on with it, shall we? So here we are out in my car. So from Sam's Club, we always get um, the Members Mark toilet paper, and this will last us quite a while. There's just Daryl and myself, so. And he always teases me about how fast I go through toilet paper. <laughs> and then I got the Fresh Step Total Control Clumping Cat Litter, because we have two cats, and this is the best cat litter ever. Fresh Step is the best, in my opinion, and this is awesome. And it leaves behind a sparkling clean scent. I can't really vouch for that. I don't sit and stick my nose in it, but it's really nice. I really like it and yeah. And it's a low dust formula too, so that makes it a lot nicer. So that was from the Sam's Club. Continuing on with Sam's Club, I just got this bottle of Citrical. I take two of these a day. Um, my doctor wants me to do that. And I bought some Culturel. I've had this before, but I've only had like the 30 count. And so this time I got the 80 count. And I got it, of course, at Sam's Club. So hopefully um, this will work well with my stomach and I'll have longer to see what it's like. I'll have a good 80 days to see what it's like before I run out. And this, you just take one capillet a day. So I thought I'd give that a try. Now at um, PetSmart, I just had to go in for some of this Purina Pro Plan cat food. This is a nice soft pate that my cats love. Lola, bless her heart, she's missing a few teeth because she's old and she just is losing some teeth. So I decided to get wet food for her. And she likes this pro plan because it's really soft. I can't, I've tried to get other wet food just, you know, that you can get at the regular store, but it's still not very soft for her to pick up. So this stuff is extra, extra soft. So she likes this and can eat it really well. And there you go for that. So, and so the rest is from Walmart. So let me get started. I got some more breakfast essentials. Um, the Carnation breakfast drinks. I love these and the rich milk chocolate. I look forward to one of these every single morning I, they don't give me energy, they don't fill me up, they just taste good. I love chocolate milk and these are so thick and rich and majorly delicious. They actually had the light start so I picked that one up today. Sometimes I just get the regular one, but this is still super good and thick and rich for being a light, a light kind. Oh, also at Sam's Club, one more thing I forgot. This lo mein noodle kit. That looks kind of fun. It's a classic stir-fry vegetable with noodles, sesame seeds, and sauce. And yeah, I figured I can just like cook half of it one day and half of it another day. And looks like it has kale and cabbage and I don't know what all it has in here carrots, but it looks really good, and I could totally have it vegetarian, or you could put shrimp in this, which I don't like shrimp, or I could definitely put beef in here, or certainly chicken, so I'm excited to try this. So I'm actually going to put this in the fridge right now because um, it's been out in the car for a while. Okay, so also at Sam's, or at Back to the Walmart. Simply Limeade, I just love this stuff. It is so good and refreshing. It's sweet, it has a fresh lime flavor, 
It is amazing. I love it. I'm trying a new chocolate milk. I've never seen or tasted this brand. Um, Promised Land Dairy. Midnight Chocolate Whole Milk. They had 2%, but I wanted to get the good stuff. And this looks amazing. So I'm excited to try it. Usually I get um, Dairy Gold, but they didn't have it. So I tried this one, or and I'm going to grab this, and I can't wait to try it. Needed some Mr. Plumber, and this is just the 88 cent bottle, you guys, and this works just fine. I use it in my bathroom sinks and my bathtubs and my shower, and it works really, really well, and it's 88 cents. So you should try this sometime and see if you like it before you go out and get the more expensive stuff. I saw these in that smelly aisle and I decided to give them a shot. This one is the Unstoppables in Spring and it smells really nice. And then of course I got Plain Old Gain. I wash my clothes in Gain. And sometimes I'll get the Gain plug-ins, but yeah, so I decided to try these. You get six and then here you get like a whole flower. <laughs> Interesting. So I hope this will still smell good even when it burns. Sometimes things smell good in the bottle or the can or whatever and then you you heat it up and it doesn't smell that good. I got me some cortisone tin because if you watch my vlog channel, you will know that I have what we call a hemorrhoid or two, maybe three, I don't know. And I have all these creams and my doctor even gave me a prescription cream, but one of you said this works really well, so I'm gonna try it because the prescription creams that I have, they don't work very well at all. I just wish there could be like this big numbing a big time hardcore numbing spray or cream that you can put on your hemorrhoid. I just don't know. So anyway, that's what that's for. Going along those same lines, I got me some Preparation H medicated wipes and I got this to put in my purse so I can be on the go if I have to go. So there, that's what I got these for. I got us some Metamucil Fiber Wafers. Daryl has one of these every single day, and I'll probably start joining him on that train. <laughs> the fiber train. Oh, I forgot, oh my gosh, I have another Sam's Club item. Swedish Fish. We love Swedish Fish, and these will last forever, and even when they get just a little hard and dried out, they're still really good. And we haven't had them for a while, so I decided to get some. And then I think this is the last thing from Sam's Club. I wanted to try this Forest Berry Trail Mix. You get almonds, yogurt chips, cranberries, cashews, wild blueberries, and strawberries. And I think the almonds are just lightly, lightly salted, which is good. I don't like unsalted stuff. It says they're sea salt, so we'll see. I don't know. But that looked really nice. I can put a baggie of this in my purse. At Walmart, again, I got these Hostess Bakery Petites. Um, the Cake Delights. I've tried the white ones, and they were really good. And now I decided to try the chocolate ones. And I'm sure these are going to be just as amazing. And some of you have said you can't find them, but I find them at Walmart just where all the hostess treats are and the little Debbie treats. So anyway, I'm excited to try. And they also have um, brownies and stuff. But yeah, these look good. Got my favorite unsweetened vanilla almond milk. I use this in my cereal. I just love it. I will never have anything else in my cereal again because I love the vanilla flavor. Got some more Raisin Bran. I've been on a Raisin Bran kick lately. Um, I have a bag, but there's only one more bowl left, so I got another box. I got some wheat bread. Um, I'm actually going to probably put half in the fridge and half in the freezer because 
I don't go through bread quite fast enough. And then even when I put it in the fridge, it stays for a while, but I just can't eat it all. So I needed some napkins. I just got the plain old great value napkins. The Walmart that I went to today makes their own flour tortillas. Oh, and you can see they are they were made not too long ago. They've still got the steam inside. These are amazing. Just absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing. And they're only two bucks. If, you, if your Walmart makes these, pick some up. They're incredible. They are incredible. And if you use the Walmart Colby Jack shredded cheese and melt it in the microwave with this, oh, it's heaven because Walmart has the best Colby Jack shredded cheese ever. I grabbed a Caesar salad kit. This one's the chopped one. We like the chopped salad. They're fun to eat and we just like chopped. I grabbed some gala apples. I don't know if they're gala or gala, but I needed some apples. And I actually have some caramel dip in my cupboard, so I will eat the apples with the caramel dip. I grabbed some bananas, just three. And I grabbed Daryl his favorite candy bars, the Milky Way Midnight. Um, you get two in a pack here. And these are my favorite cookies, the Milano Double Dark Chocolate. Oh, baby. They're double dark chocolate, which means there's kind of an extra layer of chocolate in there. And so they're a little thicker than the other ones. Oh, they're so good. And then I saw these right next to them. I've never seen these before. Cinnamon and sugar chips ahoy thins. And it looks like they have white chocolate chips in, in them too. So I'm excited. Four cookies, 150 calories. So I'm excited to try these. They, I, for some reason, I'm thinking they might taste like a snickerdoodle. And then I got some white cheddar skinny pop. Recently, I went to the Dollar Tree and got some white cheddar popcorn, and it was really good. And I decided I wanted to get the skinny pop in the white cheddar because it's a lot less fattening than the regular stuff that you can get. So, yep. And this is sharing size, but I ain't sharing. And then the last two things at Walmart, I saw this kitty tank top and I had to have it. It's made out of that super soft, stretchy material. And oh my gosh, this is an extra large and it was $3.88. And I can totally wear this under a denim jacket or a white sweater or a gray sweater or a black sweater. It is so cute. So I'm excited to try that out. And then lastly, I got this shirt from Walmart and this was $15, what was it, $15.44. And I'm hoping I'll like this. This is medium, it's 100% cotton. I was gonna get the small because they do look kind of big, but if this shrinks, then um, I wanted to get a medium. But I just got this because I like how loose and airy it is and I can wear it with my gray sweats have a little elegance going on while I've got a little bit of partying going on down at the bottom and laziness with my sweats I don't know I just really hope I like this shirt and I hope it looks good on me and I hope it works out so that's it for my haul everybody I know it's not as big as some people's hauls but it's just me and my husband, we don't have kids, and so this is kind of a lot for us. So anyway, thanks for watching everybody, and we'll see you next time.